Hi everyone, thanks a lot for stopping by. My name is Bruce Schwartz. I'm from Montreal, Quebec, Canada. I have a nice 14 inch telescope thanks to this community and I'm finding a lot of UFOs on the surface. Yesterday's UFOs with the P900, this is close up and for this footage, probably the closest that we'll get. Just taking a couple of seconds quickly to re-show the ones yesterday a bit slower, close up and of course, I took the exposure down just a little bit more, but any more than that, they'll disappear. Imagine. So all this in maybe a minute and 20 seconds of footage. There's one or two more that come down here that I haven't even indicated. There's just so many of them. Slow it down and there are more and more. Some nice close-ups um, of the surface. Smokes, definite smokes confirmed. So long me around Copernicus Crater around Tycho Crater, we'll see it close up, some greenery on the surface. Unless it's completely um, olivine all over the surface, I highly doubt that. It, maybe it's not vegetation, but I'll tell you what, the greenery on the surface is the virtual physical surface. We can see that. It's not fringing light, nor is it chromatic aberration. Thanks for watching, everyone. Uh, a lot of videos coming up again for the next few days i'll have friday off and i'll be working hard on the videos and in the footage we're gonna get in really close crazy close working on another technique thanks for watching everyone
Well, I guess it's only normal that not everyone believes me, right? That I've found some UFOs on the surface and that these UFOs are actually on the surface. It's a matter of credibility, a matter of trust. And I think after a while, you know, I'm not rushing this. I don't care if it takes 20 years or 30 years. This is something I want to offer all my my friends here online, all you guys. You know, we can disagree, guys. It doesn't mean um, we're always going to agree on everything, but we're going to have to agree on one thing. The moon is active, and that's irrefutable. Nobody can say anything against that. And, you know, we often... When we believe in something, well, we really want others around us to believe that. And I'm not going to do that because I I have friends that, you know, we differ in opinions and that's okay. I mean, that's what makes us unique as humans. We each have our own train of thought, our own ideas, our own um, ways of you know, sorting through problems. We each have our own beliefs. So I respect that from everyone. But integrate this into your beliefs. You know, there's something up there and probably was not told to us. <laughs> That's for sure. They're all over the place, guys. There's not just one, okay? There are thousands of objects flying every which way and there's structures on the surface. Massive pipes or tunnels or you know i could only imagine what's inside of the surface of the moon it must be <laughs> it must be pretty huge um you know i could only all these systems that would be underground possibly look at this photo here and actually hang on i gotta get a nice really nice photo up for you guys this looks like a square panel i'm seeing a lot of squares that's what i got the circle up on just at the bottom of that massive pipe there well, look what we're looking at here. What do you think of this surface? These objects are, look at the one on the corner right there. I'll get a circle up on it. This is massive, absolutely constructed. It's massive and you can see it for yourself on the surface. And this is only one object of probably thousands that are on the surface of the moon. Thanks so much for watching everyone. A lot of great videos coming up this week.